Hello everyone, today's episode will be dedicated to the difference between AR, MR, and VR. Nowadays, all these terms are combined in a new word called XR or extended reality. Some people say it's a general term for all these real and virtual combined technologies. And some people say that XR is a future technology that combines AR, MR, and VR all together. Anyway, XR includes all of these. Let us know in the comments which of these XR technologies are you more familiar with? Which of them you have already tried to use in your daily life? And how do you think it will change our life? I believe that most of you already tried to use it for different purposes, for example, AR for choosing the color of your car, and VR for seeing the city from the bird's eye. Moreover, we can see that VR is slowly being integrated into social media. Let's take a look at the history of extended reality. The first mention of extended reality was in 1838 when Charles Wheatstone demonstrated his research about two-dimensional images processed by the brain. Then, 1960 was the year of the first VR headset which raised the development of VR in the following years. And in 20 more years after that, in 1987 the name, virtual reality, was born. Okay, let's take a closer look at each of the XR technologies, and try to better understand each of them and their differences. The AR means augmented reality, is an enhanced version of the real physical world that is achieved through the use of digital visual elements, sound, or other sensory stimuli delivered via technology. For instance, by wearing AR glasses we can have more advanced navigation, weather information, shopping, communication, control, and other functions. Nowadays, there are many brands have already created AR products for us. AR is available for us with AR glasses and with our mobile devices. For example, AR video games and apps. More and more mobile game developers release AR game projects every year, such as Pokemon Go, The Witcher Monster Slayer, Transformers AR, AR Pikmin from Nintendo and Niantic, and others. Another example is Instagram filters, which are also considered AR. Next is MR or Mixed Reality. In other words, it is the coexistence of the real world and virtual world. MR is like an advanced AR. In the MR, it's not only put virtual subjects into the physical space, but also can interact with it. You can through the motion capture or space exploration to control the virtual subject. What example of MR do we have? In future, the technology will be more mature, the motion capture will be more precise. We think that MR will be used more for educational, business, and medical purposes. If you have any other examples of MR let us know in the comments. Let's move to the last one, VR. VR stands for virtual reality, it is computer-generated imagery. VR technology allows you to immerse in worlds that are completely removed from our own. Looking at the latest news, VR will be used a lot not only in games but in other fields as well, such as simulation of medicine, photography of street, etc. In future, highly possible will become into the fantasy world like those movie scenes. Let us know in the comments what is your favorite VR game, and which VR game are you looking forward to playing. That is all for today. Do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and learn more.